Hey, Mosvanda, welcome to Know Your Player with, uh, with the Warriors. Uh, could you please tell us a little bit uh, about who Ed Mosvanda is? I you know who Ed Mosvanda is. He's a goalkeeper for, for, for the Zimbabwe national team. But I was born, born in Kaloma to a soldier father. Moved to Harare when I was five or so, to Miami base. That's where I spent the better part of my, my junior life. Did primary, secondary level there. Um, started playing for Blue Swallows as soon as I left high school, 2004, I think. As a goalkeeper? Yeah, but I, was, I only started goalkeeping in 2003 when I was doing my, my, my O's. Then, so I played for Blue Swallows two years, then I moved to Chapungu in 2006. Then I played again another two years, then I joined Caps United in 2008. Yeah. Okay, now when did you start playing soccer? No, it's as, as far back as I can remember. Yeah. I don't even know, I just, I just know I, I, I play football. Yeah, it's the only thing that I know. Yeah. You're a strong guy, tough guy. Why did you choose soccer over sports like rugby, wrestling, boxing? Well, sometimes it's not a matter of choosing. It's it's it's, it's, it's just there. It's in your blood. So it, it chooses you. You're just born into it. So you don't have time to to choose it. It's already in there. Yeah. Now you're a family man. Are you married? Mm -hmm. No, I was, but I'm not now. I'm single now. And searching? Uh, not really. Not really. Yeah. Okay. Great. Now, when you're not playing soccer, what do you do? No, I just chill at home. Try and watch stuff on YouTube. Listen to music. Like I'm, I'm, I'm laid back. I'm just, I'm just at home most of the time. Yeah. Where are you playing your football now? I was at Whitbank Spurs, but my my contract is ending and. Right now, I'm, I'm unattached now. Okay. Now, when you got called out for the Warriors for, for the first time, how did it feel and how does it feel to play for, for your country? Well, the first time was way back in 2007. And yo, like there's, there's a difference now. Like when you grow into it, like you get used. But the first time, yo, it was, it was scary. Was you you're being called up and it's. It's, it's, it's energy, it's then you. So it's, it was something else. Like you'd, you'd, you'd get sleepless nights for the week that you called up. Like you know you're going to meet big, big players. So yeah, it, was, it was something else when, when I first got my, my first collapse. How tough was it to know that there's energy and tapua kapini in the squad as well? You no, know, like some, sometimes it's. it's it's not necessarily about being tough, but it's, it's a matter of accepting that this is a process. I, I still need to grow, but at least I'm being afforded the opportunity to be with these guys. It was like back in the days, like you're going into camp and you have Peter, you have Benji, you have Shereni, Joel Pasha. They, they were like big, big players then. So it was, it was something else and I was just maybe coming from the under 23s. Because I played for the 20s, the 23s, and got the call up in less than a year, so it was it was so overwhelming mm -hmm. getting to be in camp with this guy. So just the opportunity, just the feeling of being around them was just too much. Yeah. yeah. Now that you've been playing for the Warriors, um, who do you think is the funniest player in camp? No, well, like this is a crazy bunch of Warriors. This one, like, <laughs> you, you, everyone is is just crazy in their own way, like you have Kama, you have Jimmy Zingai, Tino, Evans, like this is like a different crop of warriors, like back in the days you had serious players, like people who who were like uptight, you have Benji there sitting serious, this one sitting there serious, you understand? Yeah. So, and there was so much tension back then, but now like people, like players, You've been together from junior level, so you're more like a family now. So it's quite different from from back in the days. 
this one couldn't joke with this one this one couldn't joke with this one but now everyone can mix with everyone so we just a bunch of friends who just representing mm. their country yeah who do you think is the best dribbler you is the same thing yeah. with, with 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 the funny part like people are unique in their own way because you have karma who, who is out of this world then you've got talent who's got so much pace like then you've got knowledge whose tens are incredible so everyone has got their own qualities people are different in their own way so you can't single out like this one is the best because at the end of the day these guys they deliver in their own way mm. yeah. who's the fastest player talent who do you think is the toughest hard working oh yes, that's a tough one but like i would, I would single out marship nazi but on the way yeah these guys are the grind who's the smartest in darane swag in team no like Oh, that's a tough one. And it's the same, like people are different. People, they've got their unique styles. You have Tino with his own style, Kama with his own style. So it's, it depends with, with your, your, how you feel, how you see them, but everyone is just their own. Uh, mm. you, you can never single out like this one is the smartest. It depends with how you see them and how you view smartness, but like virtually everyone is smart here, but the difference is in their styles only. Uh, Okay. Nike or Adidas? Nah, Nike all the way. Benz or BMW? Benz. Liverpool or Man United? Nah, no, I don't support any football. You don't have a club? No. <laughs> Why not? No, I don't support football. I, I, like, I've never, I've never wanted to, to, to attach myself to a team because that way you don't learn football because now you're always biased towards your team. You understand? But if you just watch football, you you allow yourself to learn from what you're seeing but now if you, if you're a Liverpool fan you will never accept like no Chelsea is better or Hazard is, is a better player you understand you always say no Salah is better than this one because you're a Liverpool fan but I've, I've, I've learned to appreciate every player every team so I just watch football I don't support anything okay so this question is going to be interesting Ronaldo or Messi? CR7 CR7 yeah Oh, so you can choose players, not clubs. Not clubs. Yeah. <laughs> well, you, if you have the chance to face up with Ronaldo, would you save all his attempts on goal? No, like that, that's that's no, that's 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 a dream that that can happen in on in dreams only. Because even the best of the best, yeah, they they've they've, they've tried it, they've, they've not stopped him. So mm -hmm. it can't happen. Uh, he's too good, that man, that guy. Okay, now, Chapreza or Winkiti? Same with football, like I don't want to align myself with, with you know, I listen to this genre or I listen to this musician. Well, this is not a genre, it's a... Yeah, it's just the same, like music, I just listen to anyone, I just listen to anything. Okay. I can select a few songs from Winkiti, a few songs from Chapreza. There is not like, I can't say, no, I, I like this one more than this, no, I... Give me one song from Winkiti. Garden. There are a lot of songs, but I just pick and choose. I just listen to anything. Can you give me a chorus? No, I can't. Say. <laughs> yeah, I've seen you sing. On the <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't. I can't sing. I can only sing to my phone. <laughs> you only sing to your phone. Yeah. Okay, you've got your phone in your no, hands. No, I'll send you video. <laughs> now, who's your all-time favorite warrior? Oh, a lot. There are a lot of them. Like, I don't like choosing people. Okay, like, give me uh, three. Energy, Kidiza, Benji, Peter, a uh, lot. Everyone, like, like back in the days, like, I had an opportunity to train with these guys. These guys were good. Mm. Yeah, they were, they were like, yo, they were big players, these guys. Now, what would you say to a young person who has the same aspirations to play for the Warriors? What would you tell them? You know, like, sometimes, like, football is a process, you understand? Sometimes you have to accept the journey you're taking. Sometimes you, 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 you're going to go down. Sometimes you're going to be rejected. Sometimes they're going to say you're not good. You just have to accept. But if it's your dream, don't, don't lose it. Yeah, just keep focused, keep working. Even you get rejected two, three times, just know it's, it's, it's a journey. One day you, you, 
you get there. You understand? So it's only a matter of, of chasing that dream. Yeah. Eddie, thank you very much for your time.